Good morning, everybody. Let's hope everything's working out correctly because I'm seeing a couple of flaws with my tablet this morning, guys. Uh, I'm currently trying to shore up some space. I've moved some files around. I'm doing this and this and that, and it's making everything act a little stupid this morning. So let's hope we don't have any problems, but we'll see how the recording goes. Uh, this is the big day, guys. It is the fifth anniversary of Fate Grand Order. So this is the Dark Comic Nerd playing Fate Grand Order. And we're going to check it out, all of it, as it starts, guys. We're right at the beginning. As you guys saw, we had the data update. Um, we are going to floor it right in. Let's see what we got going. Okay. I heard about this, guys. Um, yeah, we agree. I heard everybody had to re-agree to this because of the new update. Um, it was, I think, something incidental that happened. I'm just always privileged when the app actually works on my tablet. Because the day it doesn't work on the operating system on my tablet, I think I'll be in big trouble. But I do have a backup uh, device. So, lots of changes guys we're gonna go over them really briefly and then we're gonna see them in real time and then we are definitely gonna roll for castoria we have got so much going on okay so let's see what they updated since they did it last night And that's what I read, was that um, one four-star or above servant is guaranteed. So the way they're doing it this year, guys, is that because it's the fifth anniversary, they are um, going to be guaranteeing five-star servant, but also a four-star servant to go along with it. Now, unfortunately, I have most of the four-star servants um even the five star servant is going to make it tough um we're going to discuss that guys we got a lot going on hopefully we'll get it all out in this video um okay guys let's look at what's going on um so the first thing they are doing is because they had this um this panel at one of the expos um they are going to be dumping a whole 60 quarts on us from what i can tell um, then comes the 10 part campaign guys and it is nuts so here's all these consecutive logins that should be all this should be starting today so every day we get it right up to the 10 tickets we get that's the way it works every year I don't know if I've done this every year during where I recorded during the anniversary but we're gonna do it this year uh, eventually like I said I will be turning the camera on but that's gonna be during some of the other stuff now here's some special ones guys right here where we're going to get these ones but only for the next four days uh, there's a new difficulty added to the ember and uh treasure gathering which we never need to really do treasure gathering guys but there is now extreme which we are going to try because i think the rewards for that are going to be great um let's see yeah you only have to be level 60 so i think we can manage it all the for I think for the limited time, yeah, for the next six days only, all the quests are going to be half off the AP. So we're going to be trying to cram through that, but probably not while I'm recording. I'm going to be trying to cram through it. Um, here's where all these are going to be cut in half, all this stuff here. Yeah, I'm going to be trying that extremes up. And then here's my favorite five times the chance of getting a suit. Now, let's see if that's a lie or not. Because it's just for this 5th anniversary. It is only for the next 6 days. A lot of this is only for the next 6 days. Um, but I've seen how hard it is sometimes to get a greater super success. Let's see if it really looks like they get more commonplace. Because that would usually make a lot of people want to spend a lot more embers at one time. Thinking that you're almost locked in to get one. Well, let's see if it really is as much as it it says it is we'll be checking it out we'll maybe even do one today the command codes are um expanded guys um in the servant and craft essence second archive which is where i store my stuff they added an extra 50 slots for that they added a lot of slots for these that means it's easier to um get a lot of stuff 
uh, for command codes before you have to dump them into your second archive. And your second archive now has more room, quite a bit more room. Uh, expanded second archive, um, they went up 200 slots for those. Uh, incredible. Um, this new thing they're doing with monoprisms. Um, they're doing a thing now that when you go back um, during main events, I think you're allowed to get uh, monoprisms. But this is actually talking about a different thing, guys. But there is a thing now with mono... Actually, there's a whole bunch of things changing with monoprisms and uh, sync quartz. So what they're doing is um, the daily quest, guys. They're now going to have daily missions um, where you get to do three of these. Um, and you do three of these little quests and you can actually get 30 mana prisms and I believe this is daily so it's going to be very nice there it is clear request one two this is something new they're doing it's going on permanently uh, here's what I was talking about guys new missions added to um, blah 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 Oh, wait, no, this is a thing where you can do some new missions to get uh, new St. Quartz. We're going to be able to collect a ton of St. Quartz. It's, it's going to happen. Here's what I'm talking about right here. Rank up, 90 quest, blah, 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 blah. Um, but they start going forward, so a lot of people are probably not... Like me, I can collect Lost Belt 4, and maybe I've done 90 rank up quests, but we're going to see how many of those we can get uh, post-active. And then the friend slots have increased by five, which it's kind of cool, but, um, I'm looking right here, clear, clear all missions during three summon tickets and, oh, right here, increase friends follows by, um, and you get these, um, at least they're giving us a little bit more time to do these. Um, I'm not going to. Well, the only way you can actively do this is by um, going out there and anytime you use somebody's, anytime you use a new um, support player, you can request that they be friends with you. But we'll see if I have a lot of new friend requests because a lot of people like using my characters and we'll see. Yeah, you can now remove these command codes, guys, willy-nilly. No more code removers, which I never did any of that stuff. Um, I don't know what's going to happen with the code removers, I wonder. Um, who knows? They uh, Code removers can now be used on unlocked command code slots to return them to the lock state. Code opener will be returned, so weird, but... And now the um, strengthening quest, they should be starting today too. There should be 12 of them. 12 different servants are going to have rank up quests to strengthen their, either their skills or their noble phantasm. Here's what I was thinking of, guys. You will now be rewarded one St. Quartz Fragment as progress for rewards through the main quest. I was thinking it was a um, actual St. Quartz, but it's actually just a fragment. So, I don't know if you get those post-active or not, meaning that if you've already done all these quests, you get the quartz. But we're going to be looking at all the goodies that have come in because we've already done all this stuff. Here's the guaranteed summon. We're going to try to fit that in this morning, guys. It's going to be a nutty morning. I actually got up early just to do all this stuff with you. There is a whole new bunch of Spiritron dresses that you can now do quests, I guess, for... Um, to earn them, you also get a summoning ticket. It's going to be nuts. Here's uh, Juna, Da Vinci, Saber. Beautiful wardrobes. Uh, Okoda Aizo, I do not have him, so I won't be able to do anything. And Paul Bunyan, always one of my favorites. I can't wait to get her um, new Spiritron dress. A lot of people have been raving about it in the Japanese version. So, and we do have her, I think, all the way maxed up. And if not, it's easy enough to do. They are going to be doing the rerun of the Paul Bunyan actual event. Uh, that's going to be tough to fit that all in along with what's going on. But it's a relatively easy one. So, now this is just stuff they added to the shops. We'll be checking this stuff out. Um, yeah, they started adding the Beast Footprint. Um, into the monthly lineup for um, Rare Prisms. I doubt we'll ever really use one of those. There's the Castoria. That's usually a quest that you get to do so they can try to say, you want this character 
these are not the droids you are looking for. You know, that kind of thing. It's like, we, we, they try to psychologically... Get, we all want the characters. Who cares? Um, we don't need to have the quest. Um, increase... There's a new uh, commemorative command code just for the anniversary. Increase your NP gain by 5% on the engraved card. Crest of the Titan's Pit. Uh, the pr pure prisms are now up. I haven't fully figured out how you get them, but they are now... Available. I heard about these in Japan when they first came out. You can use these prisms to exchange for materials uh, to level up your characters with their skills and their uh, ascension. So basically, it's the materials that you need for ascension and stuff. Um, so let's see. Gather materials available in main quest part two. Awards for completing main quest. There we go. So we might have got a lot of those post active, meaning that. We've already done the... Every time I say post-active, guys, I mean that um, uh, we've already done the event, we've already done the activity, and we're going to get the reward um, post-already having done it. Battle drop balance. I heard this is great, guys. Random battle drops, the rarity for Ember and all these other things, and the drop for material, all adjusted. That's great. Servant cost ceiling. Unfortunately, I'm at such a high level, it didn't do anything for me. Dang it. Uh, I did check about that. New tutorial missions, award items, servant enhancement. Um, it's a lot of this is aimed for new masters, new soundtrack. Um, the stuff they do for new masters is fine. I'm I'm all for that. There is what we've been seeing, everybody. So uh, just to get that was to give everybody an overview. What did we get for the? Uh, what did we get for doing this? We got some Saint quartz. Okay, I'm just uh, double checking it, everybody. News. Um, we want to go... Okay, we already knew about the terms of services, and what is some of the... Um, access issues... Yeah, because people were going bat crap crazy trying to get in right after, um, the update, and then for me it was the middle of the morning, so no thank you, I was sleeping, but a lot of people were probably trying to go after their Castorias, and were probably going crazy trying to do it, so I can imagine... Um, looks like they fixed a bunch of errors as they did the new update. Oh, there was a thing about the... That was the new uh, Meltris um, skill, where she had the upgrade in the skill. So I guess they were having problems with that. A lot of times it's just that they're having problems where they the text is wrong. So, okay, so first day of the login, three quarts there. We're going to get new quarts up to Wazoo. We already knew, but okay. So their FGO fifth anniversary campaign on social media work. So we all got quarts from that. Here's the new one that's going on just during the anniversary. Mm, excuse me. Also, all righty, and that clears up everything. Let's see what goodies we have got, guys. This small bell of absolution that even people on the boards don't know what the deal is. Holy crap! 733 of those pure prisms. Like I said, guys. St. Quartz Fragments. 857. Like I said about those. Post-active, folks. Um, okay, we just got that. We just got that. This is what we just saw. We just saw. And we just saw. Okay, so out of curiosity... Um, gosh, and we got more to collect, everybody. Oh my gosh, I've got... How many fragments do I have? I have over 400 fragments held. Holy crap. All right, let's... These are the tutorial missions. Like I said, they're for new users mostly, so... Basically, this would be for new users, guys. If you do these little missions, they're, they're just a way of getting new users some new material. Let's switch this to... Can be claimed. There we go. That's what we want. This will take me a few minutes, guys. I apologize. Why is it not dropping as I collect this stuff? Okay, here's more quartz. I figure we'll start from the bottom here. 
pieces. These pieces of the certain, um, uh, what am I thinking of? Certain classes. Always useful. Always, always, always useful. Here, finally dropping. It was like I was collecting and the, the number at the top with the on the extra tab was not going down. Makes me wonder how many more tutorial missions there might be. Like I said, it's mostly for the new masters. A few more to go, guys. My apologies. I could pause you. Okay, let's see what's going on. How can it be in progress? We're actually... I mean, we've actually completed it. Gosh. This is great. Look at all the materials, guys, we're collecting. A lot of these right here are used to... Um, Bolster skills. Okay, so we missed two. There's so many, it's easy to miss some. And boom, there we go. Okay, why are you still showing one? What else did we miss? Okay, so what about the limited time? Okay, these are the friend things, guys. We've got so many. Um... That's the, the thing that'll be easy. Here's the, these are the dailies. Complete one quest and uh, you get, so those are gonna be so easy to collect and I love that. Um, let's check out guys. Oh, we forgot to do something important last time, guys. We got done some of this stuff and collected, um, collected um, the sightseeing thing here and didn't do anything with it. We sightseeing ticket and we didn't do, um, I was going to go for the two that they actually created statues for. And here's the other one right here. The other one is Saber. Because um, they actually created statues for these guys um, that they're putting out now uh, very shortly from one of, the, one of the Japanese companies. And I'll show you why this one's... Yeah, very lovely picture. So I figured I'd go for those two because I actually might go... Um, what did they have to say? Licensed by Tokyo Tower. That's funny. Yeah, same thing except where it says licensed on the bottom. It's the same text as the other one, which is what I was expecting. Okay, let's get going, guys, on everything else going on. Why is this thing got... Oh, my gosh, they show two of them now. They show... There's the one for the weekly missions. And then if you watch it blink, limited... And then daily missions. So my gosh, you have a lot to follow now. Um, yeah, so six days to do the event period, guys. I won't be doing the Bunyan stuff with you guys. Um, the This thing right here with the... If I can bring it up. Guaranteed servant, guaranteed servant. Right here, the, the servant quest. These should have started today. Who's the first one? Oh, Phantom of... Oh, wow. They unleashed the first uh, group of them. Nice. Phantom of the Opera. Okay. Um, and Arjuna, which we have both characters. Very nice. Now, Arjuna is a long ways from being ascended. Um, maybe we can change some of that today. Uh, let's look at all the stuff we have going on. Eh, there is somebody already that wants to be a friend. Um, I kind of expect a lot of that coming up because people want to get that. Um, yeah, people are going to want to get that, um, you know, reward. We're doing it, so let's go collect it ourselves. Wrong one. Dull monoprisms, it's hard to tell. Okay. All right, let's go in, guys, to the summoning thing, and from here on in, and yeah, I will admit, guys, I don't have a shirt on because it's still hot in this house, so just uh, deal with it, guys, but we're going to turn the camera on from here on out. Cut it out, you crazy piece of junk. There I am. Hey, everybody. All right. Um, okay, so here's the thing about the fifth anniversary guaranteed. One limited time, five-star servant is guaranteed. 
um, plus to commemorate just because it's the fifth anniversary, they're going to do one four star also. And here's where you pick them out from. They're doing it this year based on what year the character came out, which is really awesome to see because it tells you what year some of the characters came out. Uh, five t guaranteed summons available. Choose only one summon to perform. Um, so yeah, the problem I have with this is if I'm not mistaken, you could end up with any of these characters. Any of them. So you can't choose specifically which ones you want that I'm aware of. So let's say you all want to go after Merlin here. You could end up with Merlin. You could end up with Ezreal. You could end up with another. So unfortunately, that makes it extremely difficult. So what I've thought about doing is I'm thinking of pulling from here because I still want that Abbey Foreigner. And because, frankly... Um, there's also a limited time archer in the back that I never got my hands on from a long gone um, event. Um, now I see a three star in Avenger in the back. So, but there's a couple different characters from that one. I'm looking to see if there's any possibilities of better. But over here, the numbers that I, I mean. This one especially, everybody knows how hard the characters here are limited time. Uh, one of them, and I thought it was that one, had um, actually had uh, the foreigner, what was his name? He was just in the last event where we did the dice rolling. Uh, Voyager. Voyager. So, um, I thought about rolling in that, but you just take too It's too much of a gamble. Now, the sightseeing tour, guys, I thought about still doing some stuff. Um, it's only good today. Um, I wanted to wait. Oh, actually, no, that's not, it. that's, this block that they're doing is only good till today. My bad, guys. Um, I'm waiting for a specific block. I think it's the next turn or the one after that coming out that I want to do some stuff. I'm surprised that's still out. Okay, so we're going to take our chances, I think, on the Abbey one here. Here's the good news. Here's, here's the good news, everybody. Not only do we have 410 quarts right now, holy crap. Um, but we have plenty of servants here we don't have. Out of the lineup I see, I don't have Siegfried. I don't have Abby. I don't have one of the archers in the back who has Dames Escapes Me. I don't have um, Sammy Ramis. I don't have Scotty here. Let's hope we get somebody. Most likely, I'll get disappointed by getting somebody that I already have it's pretty much because uh, the thing is is just the block is too big so guaranteed five star means you just are guaranteed a five star but you're not guaranteed a good one we could get another Reshkigal. we could get all kinds of stuff that's just you know very actually i'm looking at the servants in the back guys i think those a lot of them might be four stars let me double check with the summon in because you know, we're going to do this we are going to do this and we're not going to try to, you know, up our chances or anything like that. Um, yeah, what block are we in? We're in this block, guys, from the 2019 block. Oh, wow, could we get some good characters, guys. Um, your five stars you, we're looking at... Um, it's some nice ones. Some very nice five stars. Um, uh, even Sherlock Holmes. Um, Ivan the Terrible, even. Um, yeah. But on the bottom one, guys, um, a lot of good characters. We could have gone for that one and gotten some of the characters we really went crazy for. But, um, so yeah, amazing. Because they're showing you this block, too. You can't really... Well, here we go, guys. Here it is. Um... Here we go, right here. Here's the small little block. And I can tell you right now, one, two, three. Wow, only five characters. Five characters that we actually have. So, yeah, five. So the thing is, is let's see if we can get one of the other ones. I wonder if it's going to screw us. It would be nice if they set the algorithm to pick something out of something you didn't already have but i don't think that's the way it's going to work they want your 15 paid quartz and they don't care how they get it all righty everybody let's go for it fingers crossed something good scotty maybe definitely want the abigail 
I'd be really happy with the Abigail. And then remember, up at the top in the back row there, we could get any of those servants. Five star. Now, some of those are three stars. I don't know why they're even showing them, but it would be nice if we can get the Archer. She's the four star. Um, she's in the back row, the very, very back. Third one from the left over here. So we start on this side here, guys. Bing, bing, bing. Third one right there with the long purple hair. So, all right, everybody, let's do this. We're gonna have some fun this morning. It's already 10.35 almost here. I was gonna go out and do some stuff this morning and I forgot we had all this going on. So we're gonna do a bunch of this stuff this morning uh, until we run out of time and we on. We run out of time as far as how much space it will take to do one video because I can do about 50 minutes worth of this stuff, guys, and then I'm probably going to have to cut it off. So, um, uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Okay. Okay, everybody, let's let it run and see what happens. We got plenty of quartz to spend, paid or otherwise. So keep in mind, guys, we are guaranteed a four star or possibly higher. So we could end up with two five stars. It is a potential. I'm sure there's plenty of people doing videos right now like me, or I've already done them this morning probably. Probably a lot of people got up really early to do them to see if they're actually going to get two five stars. Yeah, so let's check the volume up just a wee bit. Be nice to see some rings this morning. I was watching somebody do a Japanese. Look at all the casters we're getting in this. Uh, and it's the same caster over and over. You know why? It's probably the only three-star character practically in here we can get. Because they got to fill in the spaces. Um, but, yeah, um, I saw a lot of people doing some Japanese roles recently. And they get, the, they get the gold stars and the rainbow stars and stuff on there a lot better than we do. I hope they fix that. It just feels like it's a glitch in the system. Here's a craft essence. I was actually wondering if we ever even had craft essences. This is supposed to be a run-of-the-mill regular one, except for those two special characters you're supposed to get. Now, from what I understand, it, they can give you four-star craft essence or five-star craft essence, but there still should be a four-star servant in there somewhere. Well, let's see if that's what we're thinking it might be. I'm guessing the five star is going to come at the end, but... Seems like we're almost through the 11. What the heck's going on? I hope they didn't mess it up. Four star. This should be something. Is this going to be our five star? Yeah, we got an Ivan. I will take that. Not my Abigail, but I wanted one of the Ivans. So there we go. There's our extra. Maybe we'll be even super vindicated. Come on, Archer, 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 Archer. Yes, will it be the Archer I want? No, darn. But still not bad. Not bad. We'll take it. All right, let's check out Ivan. Later. Later, Ivan, dear. Taika wa sumase, dear. Yo, so de. Yo ni kashizuki. Yo, basuru ga i. Now, he's ironically from the very first Lost Belt, so there we go. So, um, all in all, not anything really super spectacular, but we did get somebody we didn't have, so that's great. So, Ivan doesn't get used as a rider by a lot of people, but he's a pretty sick character. I don't know if his skills are all that great, but he is, um, if you get him up to the higher levels, I believe you can use him as quite a tank. So, um, Mental Schism... Um, increase MP gain, that's not bad, and remove debuffs. Innocent monster, foreign, that means you get to collect critical stars. And then emergency uh, prerogative, you get to put Invincible on yourself by the looks of it. So I'm impressed. Um, but he doesn't have a lot of passive skills. That's probably why a lot of people don't use him. Um, oh, Anti-Avenger, if you uh, get him really up there. Now, here's his um, Nova Phantasm, guys. Uh, can I even pronounce it? Uh, not unless I learn to speak Russian, probably better. Um, 
Increase your MP strength. Always not a bad thing. Deal heavy damage to all enemies. So he's an AOE, so not bad. And decrease, decrease buster resistance. So he has pretty much the same effect as Berserker, Alter, Ajuga, or Ajuna, excuse me. Um, and the thing is, is that he does damage to everybody, and then um, he actually resists their buster card resistance. Uh, he, he nerfs it, basically, so that they can't... Um, they don't have quite the defense against that particular card type, is what it comes down to. So, uh, the, the Nova Phantasm is not bad. Um, let's look at the profile real quick. Very simple profile. Like I said, he was one of the first from the Lost Belt, so if you were new to the Lost Belt, he would have been one of the first few characters, so they probably added better stuff to the later characters. Um... Not bad. Strength B+. Plus. Endurance A+. Plus. Noble Phantasm A. I totally agree with that. Yeah, we already cleared the Lost Belt, so we'll be fine. Huge. Absolutely huge sprite, guys. I love this character. Um, kind of like uh, King Protea, where she's just this huge sprite. I have to have her kneel down all the time because of how it is so she can fit into the screen. I'll be interested to see as we ascend him how things will work out. So let me move my face here real quick. And then that's what we got for that, guys. We will be, um, we're going to go into enhancement. We're going to check out how are the odds for stuff as we bump up the Noble Phantasm. Oh, so our archer guys, we managed to finally get her real name to boot. So some irony. Actually, I don't think it's a coincidence that we got her because I think sometimes the game takes, um, the pull it does sometimes, these random four-star pulls, I think it sometimes takes them from whatever the last um, story thing you've worked on is, uh, or within the last little bit, because it seems like I'm always getting characters when it comes to some of these randoms that are coming from stuff I've just worked on in the main quests, and it's just kind of weird. I'm just thinking it's maybe more than a coincidence, but I can't prove it. So, there we go, guys. She's going to be up to NP4. There we go. That's what she is, guys, now. Uh, what is it? Tomo Gozen. Um, and then she, her name of her Nova Phantasm is On Oroki. What is it? Oroki? Oh, I'm not even going to be able to pronounce that right. So I'm going to... It's like Sawaka. And I'm thinking I totally maligned that. So my apologies to all Japanese people out there. <laughs> Gosh, I'm terrible at pronouncing these things. I just don't have the pronunciation for Japanese. I Sometimes, again, if I hear it enough, but... It's the hearing it part. And then I'd have to know, am I actually hearing that word? I'm sure it means something in Japanese. I'm almost positive. So, we get her a lot during certain banners. So, a few more pop up and we won't be... Uh, we'll be making rare prisms out of that. Okay, let's see what this is at this morning, guys. Let's work on... Bunyan is totally ascended, so I'm not even going to have to worry about that. Um, I got a lot of them in there, but I haven't worked on our Juna here. I got all this stuff. Um, do we have anything? No, we just got a whole bunch of new servants, but they're all castes this morning. Berserker! Boom, boom, boom. Um, let's see what happens, everybody. We'll let it run normal. I haven't eaten anything this morning yet either, guys. I want to point that out. So. Case in point, everybody. Let's try another one with some generic just to see what happens. But I am not. Oh, let's just gamble and go for it, guys. We got plenty to use. Let's see if anything happens. Remember, five times the success rate. Thank you for proving my point for me, whatever the name of this company is that puts out FGO. FGO team, thank you for proving my point for me. Because it's like, oh, the rates are five times more likely. But by the way, we increase them just for this event to the the regular chances ten times. So uh, really, we're back to normal. It's kind of like I've said before, guys. 
In retail, you want to do a sale, but you don't want to lose a lot of money. So what you do is you raise the price of the item up and then you put it on markdown. So basically by the time you're done, the item is on sale, but you're really not, the customer isn't really saving any money. They're really not. So that's what I think is happening here. I'll keep doing a, uh, one or two more guys, but I think this is a, it's not look like a total scam. Total scam, I'm, I'm very disappointed in them. I, I'm supremely disappointed in them. And yeah, we got some extras here. We got some stuff we can buy from the store too. Much better. Do you notice that was only when I was using little butt weenie embers? Yeah. Well, don't worry, we're gonna be doing some more of stuff like I said later guys, but we probably won't be doing it on the camera. So just everybody be aware of that. Um. Okay, guys, I gotta check on the store. The shop is next. Um, so we got a whole bunch of... This is what you guys can do with Pure Prisms. She never shuts up. So we can collect all these goodies now, guys. Look at the list of stuff. It's great. Um, so a lot of people are excited because you can collect saber pieces and everything now. And... All these things that you need for stuff, everybody's really super excited for this. So am I, but I won't be doing anything with it. We are going to collect at least one of these. There goes a thousand of my stuff, but um, that's fine. I still have plenty to use. Okay, so um, these are the ones just for the anniversary. Um... No, my, wait, what is this? Okay, these should be right. How many did I actually get though? Did I really only get 10? Oh, 100, okay, that's what was weird. I couldn't tell how many when I was gonna get, how much bang for my buck I was gonna get. Yeah, we're gonna have tickets out the wazoo. Everybody's excited about this. I will probably go back and collect some star foods later. I'm going to look into this. I did already collect all my other ones for the month, guys, for for um, experience card sets. At least it looks like I did. Yes. Though, something seemed off. But we'll look at this guy. Oh, we can't even collect that yet. It's a shame. It's just something for... Um, oh, we're going to have a big problem, guys. Let's, um, let's go clear that out before it becomes a big issue. Yokoso. Yeah, yeah, we have too many of these. My bad. Okay. Do we have... Oh, gosh. You're going to make me do it the hard way, aren't you? You piece of junk. Okay, I see what's going on. I, I'm well aware of what's going on now. Bear with me, everybody. I got too much garbage in here from past summons that are just... Look at this. The, the crap, crap. What else do we have that's garbage? Uh, definite garbage. Um... Oh, yeah. Uh, we already had plenty of those for the event. Uh, garbage, garbage, garbage. No wonder. Okay, that should clear out enough. We're going to get a super success. Jeez, there's a shocker. It's easier to do it on Craft Essence. I wonder why. Mm. At least it upped it to the next level for that, because that's one of my favorite Craft Essence to use. Um, the attack on it is, is great and all the skills are just fantastic. Okay guys, let's go in and see if we can collect this now. Just so you guys can see what it looks like. He's basically, it's Merlin in a Foo costume. And, okay, increase Master EXP gain by 1% and then Mystic Experience by 1%. So, I don't really care enough to buy five of those. Not that I had the money for it anyway. I don't know why anybody would because it's only got up it to 3%. Whoopee. Oh, it's almost like the card is actually hinting at something coming up forward in the um, in the game, too. So, yeah, plenty of stuff going on, guys, but we want to hit... Okay, we just did a super success. Um, I think we're within the minute. Who cares, though? We're going to go after our Castoria, guys. We're going to try. That's the big one. Um, I'm going to at least roll one ticket right now. See if by some random chance... Everybody says go broke for this character. Nice! I got one of the new five-star 
um, the five star CEs for the anniversary. So that's great. Not a five star servant that we wanted, but hey. So celebrate memories, increase quick card buster 8%, and begin your battle at 50%. Nice card. Nice card on a ticket. Not bad. Would have been great to get Castoria. I would have been. Anybody who gets Castoria on a ticket should be laughing their ass off all the way home, folks, I tell you. So here we go, everybody. Let's see if we can get her on the first pull. We won't even have to do any more pulls, but everybody's saying go broke for this character. Everybody's saying use up your quartz. Keep spending, spending, spending. I'm afraid that they might have hyped that up so much that they might have nerfed the rates. I'm going to see probably a lot of videos. Draw, uh, What is it? Rate up is a lie or drop rate is a lie or something like that. You get a lot of that. But, um, of course, everybody hyped this character, so they're probably going to make it difficult. I was hoping that we would be lucky because we did so well getting hey, another new one. Nice. Um, I think it's also a new one released just for the anniversary. Um, no new three star servants this year um in previous stuff we've had three star servants drop but uh, i think they're gonna hold that for the new lost belt that's coming up but yeah we did good with uh a juna altar so i'm really hoping we did good well we do good with this um let's just wait and see we're doing pretty good so far we've gotten um two four star craft essences so we can't say we did terrible um i'm limited on time that's the big one right now. That's a problem. So probably not too long after this. Let's hope we can get her shortly and then do an overview of her and then zip right into stuff. Uh, we'll have to wait and see. Now, see, we're not. We haven't been getting a lot of servants. So she is a caster. So it's ironic considering how many casters we just got in the last pull. I'm gonna probably increase my odds a little bit. But you remember what I said? I think odds are. Oh, there's another new one. Um, I think we now have the three star, the four star, and the five star that they just released for the um, for the event. But um, I believe it's how much effort you put in. You're kidding me. Are you kidding me? Oh, oh man, what a spook! I'll take it. But that was funny because I was like, it's a caster and it's gold. What are the odds we actually got Castoria? I expect spooks like that will come up often so not bad let's check out our new cards everybody brainstorming increase mp strength 15 percent increase mp charge one level when using it on your np one time so i already knew about that um i had heard about that one um i'll let you guys read the text and then let's check out this Restore 50 HP each turn and apply damage cut under. That's not bad. That's an, that's an okay small time card. And we'll probably get plenty of them, I would imagine, to be able to um, uh, up its, you know, performance. And I'll read the text later on, especially since I expect we'll get a lot more of those. So, two gold um, craft essence guys and a four star servant. You can't knock that. That worked out really good. We'll probably do a Kitashan. I don't really believe the Kitashans work, but if we happen to get a Castoria off a ticket, so much the better. If we happen to get anything good off a ticket, like we did the first one. Yeah, four star. I have a hunch that maybe um, getting uh, better stuff off the ticket is um, going to be possible here for this. It'd be nice because of the anniversary if they made it easier to get the five star. I'm thinking the hype around the character is going to get them to nerf the rates. We'll see. Yeah, so we're running low on time, guys. We might only have time to do one more pull. Because uh, i got to be careful. Let's just say this. I mean, the minutes tick by fast, but we might get lucky. We think we need two more to do the Kitashan. Unless something lucky comes up. There's a caster, but nothing that looked like it was going to be a crackle. My cat's being stupid this morning, everybody. So if you hear any extra noise in the background, that would be my cat just going nutso. 
Okay, towards the end there, it didn't get too spectacular, did it, everybody? Okay, so Kitashan in the bag. Let's go for it. And then we'll try one of my rituals if we need to and see what happens. I have not had good luck off Kitashans, but if it's anything at all, I'll consider it a success, but... Um, a lot of people are going to be trying so many different rituals this morning, you know. I saw Mist one time, he did a blind one where he puts his hands over his eyes and he got a five star, but that was on the Japanese one. That was a Jap it was the newest Japanese Guda Guda event. Um, a lot of people are going to be trying all kinds of stuff. Um, and I recommend, guys, I, I like a lot of the YouTubers out there. On my channel here, I have all the people I subscribe to. Um, public, so I recommend you check out those channels, guys. They're an awesome group of people. Some of my favorites are Mist and iStark11, but even the other guys I have listed are awesome people, guys. Yeah, so timing is going to be our big thing, like I said. Um, we have plenty of quartz. Uh, I hope we don't go broke doing this, but it's a possibility. Like I said, I expect a lot of spooks. A lot of people do a lot more fun time with this. Mist is such a he's such an exuberant guy. Um, and he does such a wonderful way of doing his broadcasts. Uh, I love him. He's just he's just way more animated than I am, and I just love that. Because I'm just so much sit back and anticipate are we gonna get anything. So far, now there's, I think, is that our first four star? I think possibly we haven't gotten too much good out of this roll. Kita Sean isn't looking so hot unless something good comes in right at the end. And that's what happened for Mist with that one he got. It came in right at the tail end of number 11 for that five star he wanted. This isn't looking so hot. I definitely want to try one of mine, guys, and see if we can do it without hopefully having the video go long. I tried to do something where I tried to fix that. We'll see if it worked. Um, I think we might get one more in. Um, yeah, that was abysmal. Damn. Kita Sean ain't working worth crap no more. <laughs> no offense. Kita Sean is a... He's a um, YouTuber also. Also has an awesome channel I recommend you guys go check out. So, um, let's see if we can get our buddy boy up here to three stars. So... We're going to do a small increment, see what happens. Like I said, I believe it's the effort you put in that gets you more back. So the longer they go with saying, screw you, we're not going to give you a super success or anything like that, the better it is for me. La, 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 la. So. Well, you guys saw, I just got a hundred. Um, I just got a hundred new embers, so... All right, there we go. Like I said, I think it has more to do with how many how many embers you put in before you try to summon. So I don't expect much out of this one, but let's see what happens. So, and I think what we'll do is we're gonna do a bonus for you guys if we do not get cast away from this roll. Let's hope we do, because um, I really don't want to go and lose all my quartz on this. Well, there's a five star, so that already does not bode well. Usually, once you, you guys know my thoughts, maybe I'm wrong. Come on, be wrong. Castoria, come on. What are you going to be? It is a rider. I had a hunt. Spook. And Astolfo. Um, uh, I don't know. MP3, maybe? MP4? Maybe we've already got it all, and it's going to be a rare prism from now on. Um, so, anyway. Um, yeah, I just... I just hope if we... Because um, I... Sort of lost my train of thought. What I was saying, guys, that that gold ring spook that that got me shaking in for a second because I was. But um, yeah, I really don't want to lose um all my quartz trying to do this um because the summer event I heard is not too long after. Um, it's coming up shortly, the next summer CE. But they're really hoping on this, guys, that everybody just uses up all their money, so you have to buy more. Now I bought some early on, um, some quartz. Uh, paid quartz because the thing is, is that they were doing a thing on the Google store where you got some extra points for um, every purchase you made of um, basically it was like you got four times the point value for every buck you spent getting a lot of those just like I said we would so this wasn't been ter terrible but I don't know if we're going to get our cast Oreo. 
I'd be curious to watch some of the other guys that I like to follow their videos, see how long it did take them to get it. I wish we could just do one straight, guys, but here it is almost 11. I've got to get ready for work, and I don't know how much longer the video will go before it will um, cut off and start a new video. Another one. Another one I already have. I said it, guys. I said it was going to be sp it's spook central time. We're going to get all kinds of spooks from this. Which is not bad, but everybody wants that Castoria. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is sad. Give me a five-star serving. Give me my Castoria along with all these. And I will just, I'll just cry just about. We are going to do some tickets at the end too, guys. I know. Look at that. Three, three, four star servants. And if I, once we got that five star craft essence, which I don't really care for that thing right at the beginning. I think I knew we were screwed. Uh, let's do a couple tickets, guys, and hope that the video hasn't dropped off. And I don't, because here's the problem. If it stops, I have to then stitch it together. And it's a pain in the butt. Okay, we already know what it's going to be. No gold rings means I'm just skipping. Nice! That was a new four-star... Well, not a new one. We already had it. That's Valkyrie. Hey, we get to do a times two. So we won't skip this next one because I didn't see gold rings, so it must have either been a crackle or something else. I should have waited on that one. It would have been nice to just get the surprise. Yeah, two servants. That's something. Not the right classes we need, unfortunately. We are going to have so many things I got to dump this morning. Now, we're going to do one more. We're going to get it down to even. And you know what, guys? I am actually going to... I would like to see where the video splits off. So we are going to do... We are going to do another roll. Consider this almost another key to Sean. Um, I'd like to see, because I increased. Basically, the video stops and starts a new video during recording whenever the file size reaches a certain size. So, because we looked at a lot of text this morning before we started rolling, the file size might not be too large. So, the thing is, is that I think we actually might be able to make it quite a bit before it actually drops the, because the file size is reached the maximum and then it starts another video. Now, I'm going to say this right now though. We'll see if this ends up being a two-parter video because if it does split, instead of trying to stitch it together, I'm just going to post these up as two-parters. But I'm not really expecting much out of this roll, but I think we can afford to just go for it and see what happens. Let's see if we get any spooks. Let's see if it's like the last key to Sean where it was terrible. Because what a shame. Remember, guys, the one where we got all those servants? If I'm not mistaken, that was during my ritual where I went out there and did that thing first and got that super success. Oh, yeah, baby, that worked out great. As like I said, this one's looking abysmal. I don't want to do the thing where a lot of them do. They, they tap on the screen, they skip to the end, and then it shows you all the four and five stars you got. Because I just think it takes away some of the joy of just getting it in the middle of a roll. Mist does this a lot, too. And he puts a lot of sound effects and stuff in. The man does a great job. He's actually done so great in some of his videos. Some of them show up in advertisements now. I think we get we did get a four star already, which I think it was this one. Hey, getting a couple more of these means that I can do a limit break on them. I wish we'd gotten more servants though here. Well, there we go. Uh, we actually have got a fair amount of servants. I guess I wish I had a gold servant of a certain kind. <laughs> a lot of spooks this morning. Not too bad, but yeah, I'm really worried. I'm 
Not super worried if we have to pay for more quartz, but we've gotten so much quartz from this event, uh, the, the anniversary event. I really hope we wouldn't have to pay for more, but let's see what happens. So we got two gold cards. They ended up being the same one. No Castoria still, um, but we still got plenty of quartz left to use. So yeah, I am going to finish it up, guys, right here. See what happens. If it ends up being a two-parter, it ends up being a two-parter. We'll see. Um, I'd like to know what my limits are. Uh, and I really wanted to just do that. So no joy yet, except for a whole bunch of spook servants. So I am going to go start making myself some lunch. And at the same time, this is my last day, guys, for my work week. So tomorrow we will definitely be back. We'll probably be back tonight. Let's just be honest. And we'll be doing a whole bunch of stuff, guys. Trust me. So in the meantime, this has been the Dark Comic Nerd. Peace out, everybody. Good luck on your rolls. And we will see you on the next one, everybody.